Hi, today we're going to show you how to do a firmware update on your Laser MP4 player. So the model number of the device is the MP4-P20-BLK. So first of all we need to download the firmware by going to the Laser website www.laserco.com.au and when, once on the site just type in the um, model number mp4-p20-blk okay and just select that okay the product will come up so just go over to the download section and download the firmware update and tool okay once you've downloaded that okay once that's finished downloading uh, go to where your downloads are normally kept so in my case it would be the downloads folder so there we have the file so we want to extract that file or unzip it so I can extract files here so make sure you have a zip program like winzip or 7zip which is the one I use so just go ahead and extract that okay now that's done just open up the folder and we want to double click the factory tool application okay so here we have the factory tool now first thing you want to do if you can't read Chinese is just go over to this little globe icon and select the second option so that'll change it to English okay so from now we just want to plug our device in so we've got the mp4 player here and we've got a USB cable running to one of the USB ports on our computer I'm just going to go ahead and plug the other end of the cable into that. Okay. Now once that's plugged in, you should see one of these ports actually turn a different color. So for me it's port 4 here. Let's turn blue. So we can see that's actually connected. If that doesn't come up, then your device isn't recognizing it. So you might have to update USB drivers or something. Okay, so we want to just go ahead and select the um, firmware option here. Okay, and we want to select this file here, the HT8192P7 file. So just go ahead and open that. Okay, great. Now we want to select upgrade and go over to demo here. And you can basically use any file here, but um, I've included a file that you can actually use in the directory. It's called demo. So just go to where you un unzipped those files and select the demo file and select OK. OK, now that that's all set up, you want to just hit the um, run button. OK. So you'll see something come up here. Find user disk paths, format disk start. And after that it should complete. Okay, so that's done. Upgrade OK. And there we have it. That's all done. Thank you.